Holy shit, TZ, thank you for the resub. Perfect timing, I just pressed record. <laughs> I'll let that go off. Fleep, fleep, fleep. Fleep, fleep, fleep. So what is up, Pidgey, Icker, Cookie, and TZ? How are you guys doing? Um, tonight we're playing some more Elden Ring. Surprise, surprise, right? Who would have guessed? Um... <clears throat> So a no, a no horse run in this game would be all kinds of uh, unpleasant, I feel like. Um, so what were we doing last time? We were at the capital. The old capital city, huh? I was running around off stream, just messing around. That's why we're at the round table right now. Hydrate? What's up, Retro? I will drink coffee, because that's hydrating, right? <sighs> You didn't know how to use the cell in Wind Waker? I don't remember how to do that either. <laughs> if I'm being honest with you. Alright, so. I don't think we have anything to do here. Also, hold on one second. Let me look at something. Just check something out real quick. Okay. Alright, alright. Looks good. Alright, perfect. Everything's good. Alright. <clears throat> Where's this mic at on my face? Is that good right there? We'll put it right there. Alright. So. Ah, finally got past the shadow version of Blade. That's good. Um, all right, you're level 76 now. What level are we at? What are we at right now? 111. What a good number. All right, so we are all the way up here. I actually found a place off stream that I want to go first. So we, we had the, um, the, the capital city, obviously. But where was it at? Right here. The Ori 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 Oriza Heroes Grave is where we're going to go next. We're going to do this dungeon, then we're going to go back to the capital. Because I will get sidetracked forever in this game. So to enter this, we need a so it's a swordstone key. Well, I guess for this corner we do. So I guess let's use it. Hopefully it is something. Oh my god! All right, all right, we're starting off that way apparently. That was fun. Uh, I have the uh, the Colossal Sword, it's the Great Sword. Now I have the Golden Epitaph though. What was that? That is a Straight Sword. Last Rites, raises the Epitaph to grant the effect of Sacred Order to yourself and allies in the vicinity. Huh, that's pretty cool. Hmm. But yeah, this is my favorite weapon in like Souls games, so that's where we're running it. Um, I don't know if it was worth the, the stone sword key for that, for this run, but, you know, other builds it probably would be good for. Oh, no. It's one of these fucking places again. Well, this is not how I wanted to start the stream, but I guess we're doing it. Why is it always rolling? That's a good question. All right, that was what? What? Oh my God, there's one on both sides. Well, that's unfortunate. Do you want a Basilisk plushie? Fuck those things. <clears throat> you once lost 500 runes to a bullshit hitbox. 500 runes is like nothing. All right, well, that was a good start. Was there anything else in this room? I like ran in and ran out besides these fuckers. For some reason in my mind, I thought they'd be dead. I don't know why. Oh, I got a new ability. Frenzy burst! You gotta yell at your attacks like an anime character for them to work. Wave of darkness! Oh no, I'm dead. <laughs> I've been turned to a tree. And there's 20,000 runes down the drain. But that's okay. Oh, 500... Thousand runes, not 500 runes. That's a lot different. Okay. Well, we're not going back in there, so fuck it. All right. So we got two roll, two uh, chariots here. Good to know. We want to run to right here. Roll. Then run down here, and stop here. Right. Okay, you are safe right in the center. Oh, you want to drop down, I think. Can we go anywhere on that side, though? I don't know if we can make that. 
Jump down. Okay, more basilisks. Because why wouldn't there be? Let's not animation lock ourselves in the, uh, the spray this time. Oh, you fucking bitch. I like the eye beam. Yeah, the hero dungeons are kind of annoying. <laughs> Seems familiar. What do we have here? Let's do this. Oh, okay, that's a good good use of beast claws right there. Completely helped me. Oh my god. Why did we why I should have just went back to the capital. If I knew this was gonna happen, I wouldn't have went here. Dude, the dodge is on that man right there. These are the worst fucking enemies, man. And they know it. That's why they put them everywhere. Isn't there another one down here somewhere? Is he caught in a corner? What the fuck? Oh, he's flying. How do I get him? Uh, let's throw a rock at him. Good enough. You were in one of the hero dungeons today. One of them had a black hand, a black hand assassin. I don't know if I fought the black hand assassin in a in, a, in one of the uh, hero rooms. That doesn't sound familiar. Oh, wait, no, no, no. All right, the black knife catacombs. That I, yeah, okay, I fought the one there. Seriously. You want to go home? Me too. Me too. All right, so we're back to this bullshit. Are there two of them going both ways? Is there one going both ways? Uh, okay, so we're, this is a... Uh, it's... I, my head was underneath of it! All right, well, that's kind of... I don't know if I agree with that. That was a bullshit death. I, I will say there haven't been too many bullshit deaths. I don't agree with that one at all. That wasn't. That didn't happen. No one saw that. Ignore it. All right, let's uh, let's try this one more time and not die to uh, bullshit roly poly chariots. Oh, this is where you lost the 500k at. Well, I can see why. Oh wait, outside was the wait the red laser dragon. I don't think I fought the uh, the red laser dragon. It doesn't sound familiar. He, you know what? He may have shown up for a second and left. I think I might know who you're talking about. I'm gonna do the age-old souls mechanic where you just run past everything. That's the one, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's called fucking pro gamer skills right there. Did someone write that down? Did someone write it down? Oh, fucking shit. All right, that's dirty from software. Come on now. What is this? What is this This area? Oh, I see what you can do here. Nope, 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 not right there. Fuck me, dude. This is not okay. Pro gamer skill. Pro gamer skills. Still got it, baby. Here we go. Dude, we're doing it. All right, so let's go over here. Carefully. Up. 
All right, let's kill some basilisks. Bonk! Stab! Oh, shit. All right, chill out. All right, good. Yeah, Lanisax, that was his name. That's the man, or the dragon. Vulgar Militia Ashes, all right. I like how it just like crawls out of the ground. Like, how's that work? These guys are too cute. Yeah, that's fucking nightmare fuel. Look at those eyes. Fucking derpy ass eyes, dude. So cute. All right, up we go. Let's see what's up here. I feel like there's gonna be shit that hits me right in the head as soon as I come out of this hole. Doesn't sound good. Okay. Oh, all right. So are you supposed to jump down onto one of these here? Could I jump down onto this if I wanted to? Is there anywhere to sit? There's nowhere to sit on these. Eight ball, is the streamer mean? Concentrate and ask again, because I'm not mean, Cookie. I'm the nicest person in here in this chat slash stream right now. I'm the kindest person. Eight ball, is streamer mean? Very doubtful. See, eight ball got my back, guys. I don't know why you're trying to manipulate his RNG. All right. He's sentient. Come on now. Peepo kindness. Try ranged battle. Oh, fuck. All right. Um, why would you try ranged battle? Just do that. Bitch. Ah, oh, well done. Ah, oh, confidence. What is this? Oh, you can see it between the wall there. Try hole. Of course. Praise it. You did it. So where is this going to come back to now? <clears throat> Pickle is here? Oh, one of the things that people said. Whoa, what was that graphical flash of light? That was weird. Did you guys see that? Oh, that's not a graphical flash of light. Something's trying to kill me. What the fuck is that? Is this a different place? Oh, it is. A pre-order? A pre-order of what? I'm not gonna make it. I knew it. As soon as I left, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make it. Oh yeah, the Kirby game did come out, didn't it? It got really good reviews. I don't know if you guys saw that or not. Like it was like 9.5s out of 10 and shit. People are on the Kirby hype train. It's like, it, what, what it made me think of was Nier Automata at Kirby, personally. I've never played a Kirby game before. Try jumping. Ooh, dude, the Tiny Tina game looks sick, Icker. Um, I think I was gonna see if RP wants to play it. I didn't know it was coming out soon, or now. So Cookie, you're a fan of the Kirby games? Always thought they were too short though. Yeah, Retro, never played a Kirby game. Your Resident Legend of Zelda not player also. Oh wait, no, 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 he's right. I played Kirby Air Ride. All right, fuck it, never mind. I played Kirby Air Ride if that counts. So, never mind, never mind. You've only played Link to Pass on, on the Super Nintendo? Well, that's like one of the best ones though, I think. I mean, I played that one. So I think you played like one of the best.
Oh, see, see, I told you, Eight Ball got like he's 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 a real one, dude. He knew he knew that I lied about that or mistakenly gave the wrong answer is how I would have said it, not lie. But you know, to each their own. Whoa! I looked at chat and there's a skeleton there. That's not a fake wall. You know, I should not have this much trouble in this fucking area. Oh, wait. So, that won't allow you to get up there, though. Fucking pro gamer skills! Dude, I'm just like... My mom's an illusionary wall. What does that even mean? Is that a statue of Marika right there? Is there? There's probably a boss right here then, yeah. So we definitely missed something behind us though, where we were going before. There's probably something back there. Why am I fighting you? Why? I don't care about you. Why? No, I'll kill you. For personal reasons. I love having to hit enemies so many times still. There we go. Alright, let's buff up and fuck a boss up. Oh, fuck that shit, dude. I'm calling him back up. You want to double team me? I'll double team you. I've seen this fucking... Whoa! Hey, everybody. Let's calm the fuck down. Before we start the fight. How about that, huh? Wave of darkness! There's a stand in it, dude. Fucking Crucible Knight Ordobis. That's even your real name. Ow. Oh, uh, you're gonna you gonna grow wings? Of course you are. Spear! Oh, I dodged it. I like how he spins his spear to do an attack. That's kind of cool. Fucking crucible knights in there. Unlimited boys. There's a grab. Fucking command grab. Of course. Why wouldn't you have one? Yeah, let's combo it up now, buddy. Huh? Fucking cool, dude. Really cool. Ooh, my, my Mimic was also getting his ass kicked. Ooh, so you're caught up with Attack on Titan now, Retro. Fuck yeah, dude. How you liking it? The new opening is fuck. It goes hard as fuck. I agree. Nah, I'm not salty. That's fake anger. Listen, dude. I sat there and fought our last Raven bosses for three hours apiece. Nothing in this game can make me angry. Like, it would be some effort for me to get upset about any of this. Alright, well that, that kind of makes me upset, actually. That, that guy made me upset. I mean, it's a different kind of difficulty. Like, last room would, would be a different... That's a lightning spear. I, wanted, I don't want that. You gotta love the double crucible knife fight. I don't know what the timing is on that, really. I think I'd rather fight Ordovis than the original crucible knight. Maybe not. All my stuff. What the fuck is it? There it is. Oh, fuck you, dude.
Why didn't that last that last uh, gravity well didn't hit him? That's weird. All right, he's a uh, phase shifting. Boom. Boom. Oh, the stagger! I fucked it up. All right, that's one down. Oh no, not the mimic! No! My brother! Or my clone, I guess. All right, grow your wings, try to stab me. Nice job. I'm gonna shield bash you. Oh, really? Outside the gravity well, too. What a bitch. Coward. You love the scene where when uh, Barricades played, it was it was so awesome. Oh, yeah, dude, it definitely was. My brother's in Christ. No, the tail swipe! I actually have that ability now. The big ball. That's called poise. Oh wait, that was a. This is this is Ordovis. The other night that I fought was the Spear Knight wasn't Ordovis. I thought the Spear Knight was him. What the fuck is the double tell? What is that? No, I never saw them do that before. I've only seen the tingle, the, the tingle, the single tail swipe. Huh. All right. You really glad the anime reads this amazing soundtrack? Yeah. Dude, everything about the last season of Attack on Titan is just incredible. They did, they're doing such a good job with it. I'm not fighting those skeletons, so we're just gonna run. I never even actually this is gonna might sound insane. I've never watched Breaking Bad before either. Cause you just recommend to watch Better Call Saul. That's that was I'm not sure how I feel about that going through the wall. Oh, you fucking bitches. Backstab, if only. I'm letting you get the final blow. All right, I'll do it. All right. So we got Ordovis's great sword in the Crucible axe set now, which I'm guessing is the like the, uh, the so we had the tree set. This is the axe set. Very cool. So what is, is Ordovis's great sword a colossal great sword? It's not. Okay. Okay, um, Great Sword of Verdo is one of the two honored as foremost among the Crucible Knights. The sword is imbued with ancient holy essence. Let's see it. Small boy. Oh, it has this attack. That attack is actually kind of cool. Look, like it might be hard to get off, but that's like not bad. I don't hate that. You'd be like something like this. Uh, what do we got here? Thick boy swords. I don't really like the the, the move set for two uh, great swords. Tbh. Took my sword off. Where's my sword? There it is. Where's my thingy? There it is. Stab. I'm just gonna run past you. All right, so we need to go back down to that other area. 
and see what's going on over there. Oh wait, is Switch okay? Is the stream okay? Yeah, we don't we don't even drop frames or anything. Well, yeah, the Uchi Katana has that crazy uh, bleed damage, which I'm not sure if they nerfed or not, but stream's okay. Not yet. If that stream's gonna be fine. If it's okay right now, then it's gonna be fine the rest of the time. It's only when OBS starts up that it gets weird sometimes. What even? Well, I don't know about that. I'm not going to say that was a fair death right there. Yeah, pathetic. Yeah, no, I, that was a game. That, that, that was arguably the game's fault. I don't know how I feel about that death. That one hurt a little bit, actually. The other ones didn't hurt. That one was kind of unfair if you, you know, play it back. Well, their hitbox, it's, it's like any, if you touch them at all, it's instant death. There's no like, that's all it is. That's all it is. <laughs> Pidgey approved salt. Good. All right, we're gonna see if we can not lo lose 30,000 souls in this, this time. What? Well, there goes 30,000. That's only 50,000 for the night. <sighs> I don't know how I feel about that. This is, these places are not fun. Don't get a haircut. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. All of the hero graves have been relatively annoying. Out of everything in the game, most of, mostly the things weren't that bad, but like these fucking chariot things are just fucking stupid. I don't like them. Because I know, like, like in these games, they put stuff in here that just is plain out frustrating. Um, and that's the deal with this. It's just, they just put them in there to be frustrating. You know what I mean? So you got you got Tiny Tina on PS5. Would me and RP want to form a party? I'll ask him if he wants to buy it, uh, Fracture or Iker, because I would, uh, I'd be down. Because I love, we love Borderlands 2, and we love the DLC for Borderlands 2. Um where you uh, do the D&D &D campaign with Tiny Tina, which this is the whole game of that, right? So that's, that sounds incredible. Is there a safe zone in the center of these? Yeah, I agree. There shouldn't be damage with zero momentum. I forgot that, that was there. Uh, but yeah, I'll see if RP wants to play it. Because we, we actually are looking for a new co-op game, so that would like work perfectly. It'd be really cool if we got a fourth. Because I, I haven't played Borderlands with a full party since high school. But like by all means don't wait for us like 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 well it, it might not be for a little while but we're, we because we always planned on playing it because we saw whenever it was announced we said we were gonna play it so can you shut this thing off can i kill that thing up there or something but you can Where's the other one at? Oh.
All right, does anybody know what's down here? By chance? Like, is it good loot? Or, or are we gonna, like, you know, is it like something that I'll actually want? Or is it like a shitty, you know, talisman that I'll never use? Ever try boba tea? I have had boba tea before, it's very good. It's been a minute since I've had it, but I do, I do like it a lot, actually. Uh, me and Kelsey were actually going to make our own boba tea. We just never did it. <laughs> Can I get around that one? Probably. We'll just do this. Oh, you can just run past shit and go straight here. I see what that, okay. That actually wouldn't be, that wouldn't be helpful at all. Do you remember in like original Dark Souls, they had those, uh, those, those creatures that would spawn after so many people, after so many like souls were lost in a certain area. They were like those little like crab looking things. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? We fought one when we played Dark Souls 1 a while ago. Uh, if, if those were in this game, this would be like one of those areas where they would constantly be spawning. Alright. Now everyone knows platforming in Souls games is like not okay. <laughs> it's like always difficult. So, having a dungeon that requires you to do that is not fun. They explicitly collect souls and lore. Yeah, yeah, whatever the, like, crab-looking things were that would spawn, the little dudes. Um, they had a name. I have no idea what it is or what it was, but I just remember this is, like, one of the, like, being in this area, this is, like, somewhere where that would happen for sure. That was way too close. Honestly, you're right, Retro. Platforming in From Software is never fun. Even like in Armored Core, it's fucking annoying sometimes. So where are we gonna go? Where is the next safe spot at? Right there. Oh my god. Like, what is that? That's why it will always be a thing. That's true. Last mission in, in uh, Armor Core 1 is platforming hell. If I remember correctly, yeah, it, it's pretty fucking annoying. I mean, platforming in all of their games is kind of rough, so. So I never actually finished Mario Odyssey. I played like the first like couple hours of it and then never picked it back up. Yeah, I mean, it looked really cool. I just never, I don't know. I've never like been a Super Mario fan. Like I've played like Mario parties in the old Mario games and like Super Nintendo and, 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 and NES. And like, I'm sure a whole bunch in between there that I'm, not, I'm forgetting to say right now. But like, it never was like my go-to franchise. You know what I mean? So they put that body there so you can line this drop off off, which is kind of cool. I think the real reason to come down here was to get the armor set and the weapon. But I suppose we're this far, we might as well keep going, right? I just want to knock him down. Mario has the best party games by far. The only contender for party games that I will say is I loved Crash Bash. I still do love Crash Bash on PS1. I 
don't see what you're supposed to do here. Like, uh, wait a second. What's happening? Does it go all the way down? Yeah, a remake of Crash Bash would be dope. I'd play that shit in a heartbeat. What is the point of this this right here? I don't Uh, we'll come back here later. I'm going to the capital now. We got our fucking armor set here. <laughs> yeah, pathetic. That is, uh, that's a little rage-inducing, so... Uh, alright, so in the capital, where did we leave off at? So, this is, like, progression, I think, at the Erd Tree Sanctuary. Um... Actually, I want to go to the round table really quick, because I think there were doors in here that I didn't open up. So let's go open some doors up. Um, I want to say it's in the main room. Did I open? I did not open this door. I'm pretty sure you can open this door. Yeah. Wait, where was there a fiery dragon at? That was a, a, a platform with a little imp statue that shot fire at me. Fucking stupid. All right. So what is in here? Oh, an iron virgin. That's the name of these enemies if you didn't know, also. He's eating me. Snakes. They're power they're powered by snakes. Well they're from they're from Mount Galmir, that's why. Hey Paul, will I lose my virginity to an iron virgin all size pointed? Yes. Whatever the fuck that means. All right, there's probably a really good item down here. That's why you had to do that. I guarantee it. That sounds painful. Yeah, I don't think I'd want to lose my virginity that way either, Cookie. That does not sound like a good time. Oh, look, another one. Come on. Great. I wonder how strong the lightning spears are against you. Oh, it's opened up, that's why. That. Can you struggle? You can't. I'm dead. Oh, shit. So, I am done with Volcano Manor minus the final boss there, Pidgey, because if you defeat the final boss, it locks you out of quest lines with some NPCs. Stormhawk Axe. Let's take a look at it. It is... I don't have the decks for it. Thunderstorm. View the armament wings, armament's wing blade with lightning and swing it around to create a tempestuous lightning storm. Oh, I wonder if this is the weapon that Nefeli was using. Maybe. We can't... We don't have the decks for it, so... No, I've not been to the mountains yet. That would be the area after the capital. To get there. Because you're talking about... Over here, where this is. Also, I don't know where this goes.
Oh, this is where the divine. Yeah, it's where that other teleport spot was right there. Well, I don't think we have anything to do with the divine bridge. We've already been here before. Yeah, I, I already used the the, uh, the trap chest, so nothing to do there. Oh, they're slightly different. Okay. I kind of like the tree armor better. Are the gloves different? No. Gloves aren't different. Are the legs? No. What did I have on? Shit. Uh, Rage Wolf. And then gloves were... Blacks. Then the helmets are obviously different. We saw that already. One's this one, and then that one. That was insane, literally popping up in front of the earth tree and how fucking massive it is. Yeah, it's a uh, large tree, some would say. Um, all right, so that was the door that I knew I didn't open here. Um, I don't know if I missed anything down here anywhere. So we did the sewers, at least part of them. I don't know how long the sewers actually are. That's oh, a troll message. Cause we got the seed bed thing for uh, old dung eater, uh, which I need to go talk to him. Cause I think that might've been what he was asking for, but I don't know. The sewers are pretty fucking long that I only found a part of the sewers then. I can't poise that apparently for that. So I'm pretty sure there was another one of those dung eater items in this area somewhere that I did miss, I think. It might not be over here though. Actually, let me go up to where we fought the last boss at and see what's over here. Cause this might be where we need to go for more stuff in the capital. That's water, I think, or something. So we don't we don't want to do that. <laughs> okay, maybe this is actually what I want to do now. Let's see where this goes really quick. This is after the Godfrey boss fight. Okay, there's a. So wait, was the Godfrey boss fight not a? Or I guess let's see where that elevator goes. Oh, that's a deep elevator. Oh, so it just brings you back right here. Regression alone reveals secrets. That's a from software tip right there, not a not a uh, user tip. Regression alone reveals secrets. Anyone got any uh, insight into what that means? <laughs> Does that mean going backwards reveals secrets? Oh, dragon right there. Poor boy. Oh. All right, we've been here before. Yeah, because you drop down right here to get the uh, Grand Six weapon. So I never, I haven't been over here yet. How am I going to stop this thing? Oh. Like that. Barrier of gold. Sounds like a cool buff. Skill. Time for monstrosity. Here. Time for monstrosity makes me think boss fight. But I have already, I've already been down there. Like if we jump, well, actually, okay. Apparently you can survive that jump, which I don't understand why, but all right. Yeah, we've already been here before. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. 
use volcano parts for the AoE to kill the stuff the bugs. Regression reveals something. Secrets. Ow. Oh, he was buffed. That's why he did so much damage. Earth Tree Sanctuary is where progression is. I mean, that kind of makes sense. Being that's where the last main boss fight was. I'm pretty sure that I missed something here, though. I just don't know where it was at. It's a seedbed curse, and there's one down here somewhere. I rolled that. No, no, no. I got, I got the Grand Six uh, spear. That's the item on this, on the giant spear right there. It's a legendary weapon. Uh, no, it wasn't. Well, no, it, it was like it's not on a roof. It's like um, I just don't know how to get to it. It's not on a roof. It's um, like under like a like one of these like, what are these called? Like um. All right, hold on a second. There's too much shit going on. It's like on top of one of these things. Cupola, cu cupolas? Yeah, one of those things. Those things. Gazebo. That's the word I was looking for. That's what I was thinking of. Okay, so this is the sewers right here, which I've been to the sewers already, so I don't understand what I missed here. Blow giant hand. It's a coop, cup, cupola on a gazebo. Oh, all right. I hate these things. So you said the sewers is a very long area. Um, I did not go very far in the sewers then. Like I went down and fought and did the dungeon that repeats itself. Super trippy. So yeah, there, there are spiders in the game. To that point, Cookie, they're just the hand spiders. It is called a cupola on a gazebo confirmed. I guess that's good to know. Did I go this way? I'm pretty sure I went this way. The cupola is the dome. Yeah, so I, I did this. Cause there was an item over there we got. Then I fought this guy. That brings you here. Mm -mm -mm. Then, yeah. If you were an NPC, who would you be? You are an NPC, what are you talking about? Oh, take that, bitch. Where are my ruins at? Are they in that fucking... What are they doing over there? Wait, why are they right there? Toxic? How dare you? I'm not toxic. It was a joke! Just a laugh at my joke! He knows too much to terminate the simulation. Alright, I think we did everything we, need, we needed to do over this way too. Wait, 8-Ball, is streamer toxic? It's decidedly so. Alright, 8-Ball must be a little upset right now with me for some reason. He's having, he's he's lashing out. Ignore him for a minute. It's not cute to lash out, 8-Ball. Calm down. Huh. 
Okay, so we're back here now. Oh well. Let's go back here. To the Erd Tree Sanctuary. Wait, Apol, should we ignore you right now? Yes. Oh, there were a lot of doors here that I wasn't aware of. Okay, hold on. Did I go over here last time? I did not. There's an item here. Holy grease. Um, all right. So I think we wrote, we walked that branch up to here and jumped down. Is that how we entered this boss fight? That might've been how we entered the boss fight. No, no. Cause that branch only goes to right there. That's not how we entered the boss fight. Never mind. Where does this even, what, what is the purpose of this brand? Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. A couple of these nuts, oh no. Another grace site too. Ooh, and a bed the fuck was that oh black knife assassin I'm on Ronnie's side bro don't kill me damn dude chill blessing of the Erd tree that's a, probably a buff I'm assuming Let's see we probably can't use it if, it, if it, I'm assuming it's faith based or yeah Her name's Ronnie. R-A-N-N-I-E. Or R-A-N-N-I. The witch. Ronnie. Imagine a dude named Ronnie. <laughs> okay, uh, what was I doing? I was doing something here. Oh, memorize spell. Uh, okay, so Blessing of the Urge Tree requires... Uh, it requires 38 and 35 for, for these two we just picked up. And Barrier of Gold is 24. We can probably use that one soon. Um, Oh, shit. We don't have a lot of faith, so. Brawny. Brony. Brawny quicker, quicker picker upper. Is that a, that's a thing, right? I can land on, I landed on that candlestick. That's not how that's supposed to work. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, that's a boss fight again. We just had a boss fight. Why is there another one right here? Fuck it. We're doing it. Immersion ruined. Uh, all right, so let's do, let's do vitality first. Then electrify armor. Then pop the flask. Then watch a cutscene of a scary boss, probably. Okay, if there's a cutscene, this is big shit right here. Let's see what happens. Graceless, Thomas. It's fucking Margaret. But it's not Margaret, probably. What is thy business with these thrones? Ah, Godric the Golden. The twin prodigies, Mikola and Melania. Melania? That's how you say her name. General Radan. Praetor Rikard. Luna Princess Rani. Willful traitors. All. Thy kind are all of a piece. Oh shit. Pillagers emboldened by the flame of ambition. Okay, of course the fucking sword. Have it writ upon thy meager grave. Um, <clears throat> okay. Felled by King Morgoth. 
Last of all kings. Who the fuck is King Morgoth? I understand that's him, but who is he supposed to be in the lore? The Omen King. Whoa! Put that away. Put that away. That's your phase two weapon, buddy. Oh, he said, fuck your mimic. Oh, that's a spear. I, I, I knew he was going to throw it at me, too. All right, give me a second. Morgot, Omen King, not Margit. Uh, at random enemy. Get it, stagger locked. Okay, he went Super Saiyan. He is now Super Saiyan Morgot. Oh, that looks unpleasant for everybody. Someone write down what he's saying, because I want to know what he's, he's saying. Something good, probably. The lore. Not the mimic. No. It'd be cool if he cut his tail off. Oh, he just. That's a blood blade. I'm gonna die here, aren't I? Ooh, I didn't. All right. Is that? Is he a one phaser? One health bar, or I should say. Yes! Morgoth's Great Ruin! And Remembrance of the Omen King. It is now raining. I don't know if that's relevant, but it is. All right, let's read that. I'm curious about this man. Imagine if I remember where the remembrances were. So I don't know if we read where Dawn's. Um, the Red Lion General wielded gravitational powers which he learned in Celia during his younger days. Also, he would never have to abandon his beloved but scrawny steed. That's how he rode um, the horse when we fought him. Anyways, Remembrance of the Omen King. Remembrance of Morgoth the Omen King hewn into the Erd Tree. Um, though born one of the Graceless Omen, Morgoth took it upon himself to become the Erd Tree's protector. He loved not in return, for he was never loved, but nevertheless he loved, loved it he did. So that's why he has like roots and shit come out of him. So he was the Erd Tree's protector. Oh no! The chair! Oh, we're locked in here still. Why are we locked in here still? I didn't... What's happening? Impenetrable thorns refuse all. None may enter the Erd Tree. I don't, I don't like how we're locked in here still. Oh, I didn't touch the gray side. That's why. No, I don't. I think that was a, that was a, a personal problem. We're, we're probably supposed to rest here. Yeah. Hello again, old friend. Allow me a moment. To converse with you, you are unable to enter the Erd Tree, no? Prevented by the mantle of barbs. The thorns are impenetrable, a husk of the Erd Tree's being that spurns all that exists without. The only way to stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord is to pass the thorns. My purpose serves to aid in that very act. Okay. So I'd like you to undertake a new journey with me to the flame of ruin far above the clouds upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants. Then I can set the earth tree. That sounds bad. And guide you down the path to becoming Elden Lord. <laughs> The rolled medallion and a red mark was made on the map. Okay, so let's just talk to her. I wish to journey with you once more to the flame of ruin. Then and guide you. Oh, she said that already. Can we level up at her? I turn your runes to strength. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. Oh, we're gonna touch a girl. Me. All right, so we get one your level thoughts, up here. Um, let's put it into. The principles Faith. you will follow. And then I'm good. 
All right. You said you wanted a good AC game, and someone replied with, "God no, I want a good. I want a game with good controls and no stamina bars on a mech." Tell me you're bad at Armored Core without telling me you're bad at Armored Core. I 100% agree with that retro. First off, any mech would have a limit to how, like how long it could boost, for example. So that's a stupid argument they're making, or a stupid thing to want. Like it doesn't, I, I don't know, I just don't agree with that, I guess. Um, yeah. Your, your, your intellect is 10 and mine's only nine, so you're, you have a higher IQ than me. I guess so. Um, let's use this. I want to level up again, because I think we get a, a pretty possibly bad skill from it, but I want, I want to try something. Um, so first off, let's reorganize some shit here. I want to put on this tail swipe because it seems cool. Oh, no, no, no. Actually, fuck it. No, we're going to put on that. Or no. Let's try. Hold on. We, 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 we need to test abilities right now. So we have Scouring Black Flame. What do you guys feel? How do you guys feel about that? That's kind of cool. The Noble Presence. Dude, that's actually pretty sick. I don't know. I like both of those a lot, actually. Uh, there's more, though. I'm pretty sure. Uh, we also got Big Belly Blast. Yeah, that thing was pretty cool. Oh, we have Honed Bolt now and this Tail Swipe ability. So let's try Honed Bolt. So that doesn't seem very good, if I'm being honest with you. I mean, that seems good, right? And if you just tap it, do you do a single swipe? Yeah. I don't know. I thought that looked pretty cool, personally. Okay, so let's look at our spells. Uh, what, what do I want to keep on? So we have Lightning Spear. We probably don't need Frenzied Burst if we have Lightning Spear on. Or let's see. Let's drop Frenzied Burst. We'll just try some stuff out. I'm going to keep on Beast Claw and Lightning Spear and put on um, Scouring Flame. Actually, we'll do it in the right way. Yeah, Scouring Flame. And... Oh, wait, we have Howl of Shibiri. No, we, we can't use Howl of Shibiri. Never mind. Let's try... Um, we'll do that. We'll do... Belly Explosion. We'll do Tail Swipe and then our buffs. So I want to do Bestial Vitality. Electrify Armament and Flame Cleanse Me. I don't know. This attack just looks cool. It, it might be good against, like, probably wouldn't be good for bosses, but it could be good against uh, other enemies. That's the Crucible Knight ability right there. Okay. So we want to go, I didn't put any points into mind either. So how do we get there? Is it from, not where we're at, right? I don't, was there a way out of this area? The queen's bed chamber? I'm assuming the queen's bedchamber is Marika's bedchamber. Also, why is this her bedchamber? I don't really. All right, whatever. All right, so this is not the way you want to go. Confirmed. I do want to go right there, though. I don't think you can jump off there. That's where we need to get to. We need to go that way, right there. Oh, like across. There's the lift right there, I think. Yeah, because that's the mountaintop of the giants right there, I think. So how do I get there? You get there from right there. How do you get there? You were lost for a good minute here. Yeah, I can see why. A little unclear of like how to get over to the where the statue is or the lift is. I'm gonna guess from this way though. No, 
No other game series can do depth and distance like Souls. They, they've always been really good with that. You're right. That's not where I want to be. I want to be way over there. That was the way I, I took to get to uh, the bedchamber. I mean, you can give me a hint if you want, Pidgey. I'm not going to say no. Wandering around is never fun. Maybe you do go from over here to there. Or you can go all the way back here and like go over this way. Main road where Erdtree Avatar was? Opposite direction? Wait, main road where Erdtree Avatar was? Erdtree Avatar. Did I fight an Erdtree Avatar here? Or do you mean like way over here? Like, oh, oh, over here, over here. You're talking about like way back here, you take this road right here. Royal Avenue. Maybe I don't have that gray site. <laughs> yeah, I might not have that gray site. I have Avenue Balcony. Oh, I see where to go. I see it now on the map. Yep. Uh, we fought another boss, Icker. Another main boss, actually. Twas quite exciting. So we just want to follow this path, then. It was an old friend. That's all I'll say, because I don't want to spoil it for you for when you get there, because you happen to miss it, so... Yeah, I, I would have been running around here for a while, a while trying to find this, this the, like this one door right here that I'm assuming you couldn't open before. Like, that's why, like, at times, like, tips aren't a bad thing. Like, that's not a bad thing that you told me that. Because, like, if I was playing, like, off stream, I just, I would probably look it up after a while. Is this any good? Well, being knocked out of it is not good. I mean, that wasn't bad. It looks cool. I mean, I kind of like that. We'll use it for right now. It's probably like not actually that good, but it looks cool, right? Why's that man sneaking around? Where's he going? Um. <clears throat> okay, uh, so that's probably the way to go to the lift right there. So let's run down here and check it out. I want to try belly bop too. <laughs> That's fun. That's good fun right there. That damage isn't great, but you can chain those together, so maybe they are good. You walked the, the, the entire world map so many times just to ensure you didn't miss anything. Did you platinum the game, Pidgey, or are you trying to do that now? Is that where you're at? Let's switch it to the scouring black flame. I just hit space bar. Hold on. I don't want to do that. What was that? That tree broke. I don't like that. Who broke that tree over there? What level am I now? I think 113. Oh, hold on. Hold on. There's a, a man. Hey, it's, it's a one of the, the beast guys we fought before. Oh, he's weaker though. He's pissed. Uh, I am level 113. I don't know what 
perfume bottles do. We're collecting them, like a lot of them. Uh, will that, will that dog not aggro or something? I wonder where they're saying that. Michaela's Lily. The perfume bottles are amazing. What do you do? What do they, what do they do? Wait, wait, what? They're good as physics. What, what do you do with them? Is it part of like, do you craft something with them? Thank you. <laughs> you just found a recipe for making poison perfume. Yeah, I, um, there's this tweet that says like tarnish guys, like a Twitter account. I'm the tarnish guy that doesn't craft, but collect all the crafting stuff. There's one that reduces all damage and affects your mimic as well. So there's one time consumables then, Pidgey. Beast, not the beast. You didn't die from that? Oh, they're reusable. Oh my God, wait, what? Hold on a second. You're telling me that those perfume balls I've been collecting the entire game are reusable items I can I could be using this whole time that I've not been doing. Where, where do they even go in your inventory? I got a lot of bell bearings to turn in too. We have shit to do. He's praying to a statue of Marika, I think? Ow. Huh, you actually have hyper armor during that. Oh, they're in key items? Huh, I have five of them. Maybe we should like look into using this. Oh, you're just regular and a regular enemy type now, huh? Big boy. Great. What is this fucking shit back there? They're calling in the cavalry, huh? How far does that go? Oh, uh, not very far. What is hitting me? Who's a bow? Damn defensive bubbles. They have a healer! Yeah, the the one the perfumers with the with the crossbow and their triple shot attack literally will one shot you. All right, that is not fun. You're not being fun. That is not the right weapon or right ability. There we go. Nascent butterfly. Exalted blush. They're all praying here to something. Still no grace. Yeah, I've I have been collecting. I've I haven't really been spending any items, so we have a good bit right now. All right, this is so this is the the rolled root. So I know at some point here, you can use the Halic Tree Medallion to go to a different area. We only have one half of the Halic Tree Medallion right now though. 
And I'm pretty sure the other half is at the mountaintop of the giants. So we have to obviously get there. Is there going to be a boss fight up here? Getting boss fight vibes. Everything feels like a boss fight. I don't know about that, but Capital outskirts. Ooh, you're strong boy. Dude, where you get all that health at? Oh we have torrent? No, we don't we don't have torrent back yet. Torrent back yet. Life is one long boss fight. And you're under leveled the whole time. Oh my, stop. Bonk. That knight has 99 vitality. Yeah, he was strong, boy. Invigorating white cured meat. I might just have low damage, though, also. Like, our damage felt good, but right there it didn't feel very good. You're not dead yet? Whoa! When did they start doing that? That was pretty cool, actually. They're eating their vegetables. That was fucking sick, dude. The scarab, like, quadrupled in size. The scarab of the giant sort. You wish one turned into a boss, not gonna lie. That would be pretty cool, actually. All right, so we're approaching the left. So what we're going to do, we're going to go to the mountaintop of the giants and we're immediately going to go to Volcano Manor, request Juno Oslo. We're going to do that and we're going to go back to Volcano Manor. Hopefully finish some of the whatever remaining quest line we have. See, I feel like I think we can finish it then. I'm not sure, I guess. Wait, what is this? I don't know where we're going right now. Are you ready? In short, let there be luck. Visions of seem familiar. See the suit. What, what is that even saying? The forbidden lands. Okay, hold on. So that is this is progression then. Drawstring fire grease. This looks fucking wild. Whatever that is. So there was another path over there. I want to go back up the, the lift. So we have the wondrous physic. Um, you're telling me I could go into item crafting and go where in here? Somewhere down here and make things. Curse pot. Where are the perfume? Perfume bottles. I don't see anything that requires the perfume bottles. Oh, you need perfumer books. Okay, that's probably what I'm missing then. Yeah, I can imagine I probably missed a bunch of them. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, actually, while we're here, I don't need these. Let's pop them. I want to level up again. Um, I mean, it really should be putting more points into strength or an end vigor. I'll do that for right now. 27 was bothering me. All right, let's go back here really quick. I want, there was a, like I said, there was another path up there that I missed. I 
The Forbidden Land seems like a nice place, though. Could see my, myself vacationing there. Alright, so... Yeah, was it right here? Yeah, that doesn't look familiar. Wait, this is where I just came from? Wait, boss head, but don't give up. Wait, is this a different direction? No. Boss head this way, I'm assuming. This is where I wanted to go over here. Oh. Boss ahead. You can play Earthbound on Switch now. No shit, Cookie. It's backwards compatible or they re-released it. Was it like on the emulator thing on the Switch or is it like a like a re-release type thing? I've actually never played Earthbound and I would like be into that. What the Oh god, alright. Oh, we have a cutscene. Oh. This is some fucking Artorius walk in the abyss shit right here. There's someone right there. Friend! Oh, big boy! Why is it so dark? their abilities out. Ah, he dodged! Oh, okay, well that, that accuracy is a little concerning. Bonk! Is it over? Omen Killer Rollo. Rollo. Oh, it's through Nintendo Switch Online. Nice. I, um, I've never played Earthbound. Have you guys played Earthbound before? Yes, like nine fucking times. Damn, alright. You both have. Cool. Um... So, I've actually was looking at a game a while back that I actually bought on Steam. It's called Amori, so O-M-O-R-I. And it's supposed to be kind of similar to Earthbound in the way the game plays and everything. Um, that was another game that I thought we'd play. It's more of like a Halloween game because it gets pretty fucked up. But I know Earthbound also gets pretty messed up because I'm aware of the boss fight at the end. Like, how could you not be aware of that, right? Amori's another Earthbound inspired game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay, so then I'm not crazy. Yeah. It, so, what I've seen about, like, from it, it does seem like it's a very, very cool game that I was considering playing on the channel one time. It is an RPG, but I think it actually has some pretty heavy themes in it, too. Like, mental health stuff. It, it, it could be pretty cool, though, to play. Look carefully. Well, wait. Hey, look, there's a... Oh. Wait. Oh, wait, can you... I'm pretty sure the Divine Towers make a ring. Did I beat Legends Arceus? I actually didn't. What is that? I don't like how I was sitting these fingers right here. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Eight Ball, is Earthbound cooler than Elden Ring? Uh, Eight Ball says, you may rely on it. Uh, uh, Eight Ball's a comp So Eight Ball is, is, he has some hot takes sometimes, okay? Give, you, know, you gotta let him have his own opinions. 
even if they're wrong. All right, is that everything here then? I didn't. I don't think I missed anything. Okay, so Forbidden Lands is 100%, you know, progress. Uh, is wait, April is Barbie Horse Adventure the best game ever? You may rely on it. See, he's having a rough day. All right, cut him some slack. The Noble Gold Mask. I still haven't figured out what to do about the Noble Gold Mask either. We didn't go here yet either. There's actually a couple things we need to do still that I haven't done yet. Um, I want to go here. How do I get here? What would be the best way to get to right there? Let's go for a trip. Yeah, eight balls on one right now. All right, uh, let's see here. I'm guessing there's probably a way up over here somewhere. April, are you a good person? Concentrate and ask again. The fuck was that noise? Oh, hey, I'm not trying to fuck with you. Chill. Concentrating. April, are you a good person? Yeah, ruin, ruin bears are brutal. So I wonder if you type something in front of eight ball like that, Pidgey, or a, a cookie. I wonder if it doesn't work then. I've, I've, that's probably how the command works. Because I didn't write the command, I just copy pasted it in. You probably only can you you, you could probably have to start the line of text with exclamation point eight ball. Uh, I don't know what Amber Starlight's for, but I just found it. No parse command left my no. I I didn't write eight but I didn't write the eight bot command uh, the the eight ball command, so why are they standing why are the squids around this? Hold on, what what did I pick up? Uh, an ephemeral sliver that gives off a pale amber glow, what remains of a passing flash of starlight. If the stars command our fates, then amber hued stars must command the fates of the gods. Such is the belief that inspired the use of these shards to prepare a most special draft. Cannot be consumed by mere human. All right, there's no yes. Okay. Okay. There's no weather or quote command. Don't Don't start losing your shit Soliloquy I can say word see All right, so this is not how you get up obviously We did find something for somebody <laughs> Keep a riot an army of people riots Okay, hold on. This is up. Ah, eh, not up enough though. Well, hold on, maybe it is. Maybe there's a torrent jump over here or something. A lot of wolves. Did I go there? Fuck do you. Oh, you get up there from right here. And follow that. Hold on a second though. I don't think I went to that minor Erd tree yet. Skyrim horse better than Torrent. Uh, do we need to start posting up any long links again? Oh, no, please don't do that. Oh, you just jumped on the bridge, probably. 
So I think for all intents and purposes, we are done with the uh, capital rifle right now. Uh, there's probably some stuff we missed there, I guarantee it, but we'll go back there later. What the, f what the fuck is that noise? Thank you for saying intents and purposes. Wait, how do, what is the other way people say it? Yo, what is that? What is this noise? Oh, is these fucking like Cthulhu looking fucking dudes down here. Tentacle faces. It's been a while since we've seen them actually. They shit gold apparently. Oh, stop that. Intensive purposes. Yeah, it's intense and purposes. Yo, what is that? That's a thick boy right there. What are you? Holy shit, the worm face. Oh, his face is literally worms. Oh no, we're gonna see it. Oh no, he's eating me. That was cool. I don't like the worm face. That's just all fucking decay. Oh, he's calling him fucking backup. I feel bad for the mimic. I just put him in the middle of death. Actually, I don't. Oh, yep, yep. My, my mimic got, got uh, plagued or whatever. My nose is itchy. Fuck! Of course! The big suck. Oh no. You all you faced the worm face today? The wood bolt ruins. Yeah, I've not been down here yet. <laughs> Obviously. Jeez. Fucking worm face, huh? That was worth 10,000? All right, Crimson Spill Crystal Tier and Speckled Hard Tier. You're not bad. Hey, thanks. No! You're getting one shot at left and right and had to resort to the mimic. Oh, for this guy? Yeah, pathetic. Yeah, that was a pretty good that that was fucking dumb right there. <laughs> Insta killed. Oh, these fucking worm faces. I wonder what their deal is. Why do they have golden shit? Why what is the deal with that, huh? Golden slam. All right. I'm pretty sure this is. Hold on. Let's kill these things really quick. Are they like tree people with like sentient worms in their faces or something? There's a lot of them, too. Jesus. 
Alright, we need to follow this person. Ghost. Oh, there's a whole fucking gaggle of them right there. Oh, you're walking right towards them, aren't you? Of course you are. They're having a quorum. They don't like getting smacked in their worm face. This one's a long boy, if you remember, like Lord of the Rings long with Frodo. We're going on the long walk. Laggardly sort of bluff at that. Oh, 13, uh, 1,300 uh, likes on that. All right, so I can't use those two unless I pop the rune arc. Our bait is too low. Three hours later, that would be hilarious if it took that long. <laughs> this guy walks like he shit himself. He's having a bad day, dude. I don't like all the mumbling of these fucking worm dudes around me. It's kind of terrifying in your ears. Be fun if you just kept walking in circles. You literally started browsing Reddit. wasn't that bad. A mine. A mine. Oh, there's a there's something right there. The Altus Tunnel. Which we have not found yet, though. Let's go through here and get some upgrade mats. I think there was a, uh, a jump off point over here. Oh, I, wrong one. Jump the gun there. Try again. The wood folk ruins. We didn't finish that. We didn't finish that. There's probably there's something. There's an ever gel right there. Probably. We didn't go up to where I wanted to go yet. Like we have. There's so much fucking shit in this game. You know damn well that humanity still lives beyond the walls. But playing through this game, you actually felt like humanity is almost annihilated. By playing through which game? Are you which which game are you talking about? Retro. Attack on Titan? Uh, I played the new God of War, uh, Pidgey. I bought it when it came out. Or are you talking about humanity seems like it's annihilated in Elden Ring because it isn't doing too hot here either. Yeah, I beat it. Oh, attack the uh, second Attack on Titan game, right, right, right. Well, that's because it's a it's a Warriors game, so you have to take that with a grain of salt. But the way they represented it. Clap 
Empress. Used Ice Beam, apparently. When I played through the, the 2018 God of War, I didn't play on the hardest difficulty or anything. And I also didn't 100% it, I just played through it, but like, like the main story. I do want to go back and play it and be more thorough at some point. Maybe on stream even. Fuck. Yeah, Ragnarok was announced a decent while ago. Uh, I no, I don't think I beat the Valkyrie Queen when I did it. I played like I went through like really fast. Like I missed a lot of stuff there. Or in the game when I played through it. That's why I want to play it again and be more thorough with it. I like how these little dudes have like have little wings on them now. We really do need an alternate weapon for the build. I, I love the greatsword, but it'd be, it'd be fun to swap out to something else at some point. Something else at some point. I just don't know what I use. What the fuck is that noise? Oh, one of these things. A little astal. Jesus, I can't believe you used that golden halberd the entire game. Like, how'd you not lose your mind? Oh, it's a side. So that's a different area over there. Oh, we'll go there first before we make the boss. Oh, wait. That, that's like, am I going to be in the arena if I open this? No, I shouldn't be, right? Okay, I guess I am. I don't even know why I, I even considered doing this the right, like, without by myself. Fuck that shit, dude. I'm calling them the mimic. These, these guys are so fucking annoying. Warriors. I hate these enemies so much. I think I got scarred by them whenever I fought them, the, the rot ones over in Kaled, I think. That just like was not a pleasant experience. Cause I fought them really early, comparatively to where I should have been in the game, and it was just a pain in the ass. You summon the wolfies, yeah. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Wait. Wait, I'm I'm lost. How did I get lost? I mean, the so the game is definitely built around using your summons. Like there are certain boss fights where if you don't use your summons, like you're just going to have a bad time. Like oh, like an like an extremely bad time. Like like especially a lot of the double fights cuz there's a lot more double fights in this game. Like they clearly intend for you to use summons for some of these things. I know there's a large amount of people out there now saying like, oh, you're fucking using summons. Like, that's fucking cheating. It's bullshit. You shouldn't be doing that. Fuck them. 
From software, put it in the game because they want you to use it. That's all you need to know. You wish someone would have told you because you thought you, you you could not get good. Yeah, I mean, it's just you need to use them in this game. That's all there is to it. Uh, that was a drop off there. And drop offs are bad. The fu oh, was, I forgot there's a little, little fucking little, oh, there's so much bullshit that I killed here that I already forgot about. not the right way. Nor is this a fake wall, right? No. Ow! I'm surprised their curve swords don't build up bleed on you also. Lapras! Aww. This works for trying to form a union I killed him. Let it fire off another uh, another volley. So are those like minor void creatures, like 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 that baby assholes, pretty much. They must be. Oh, the, the next level of the arsenal charm. Nice. So can I get over to them? I can. How the fuck do I get over to you? Oh, it's a different dungeon, okay. Oh, well I, f I found the great jar arsenal, so that does not help me here. Oh, you're, you're in the opposite scenario, trying to figure out how to get over to where I'm at? Huh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that's interesting. It's a separate dungeon completely. That that would have been another one that would have took a minute to figure out, probably. Well, From Software has always been good about building these in the Souls games, building these really cohesive worlds. So, I'm not surprised. We're gonna go 45 vigor. I think 45 is good. 50 is probably where I want to be by end game. But we'll get to 45 right now, then put some more points in the strength. how they're like mumbling or some shit. I don't like that. Stop.
Why do they have golden shit? I do love this attack a lot. It's so cool. What the fuck is happening with that guy? No, believe it or not, my shit is not golden. Is yours? What we got? Wrath of Gold. Okay. Another miracle. Oh, you're talking about the, the, the alcohol with the golden flakes in it. I, I know what you're talking about. I forget what it's called though, off the top of my head. Gold Schlager, that's what it is. It's not vodka, I'm pretty sure, based off that name. It sounds German. Real men drink piss water. What? Let me charge my abilities up. I'm stuck here now. Alright, what we got here? We got a gravel stone. Fucking slugs. Help me, worm face. I'm stuck in this jar. Please, not the worm face. Why am I fat rolling? The icon shield. Nice. I'm guessing that's why they want you to come over here. Like, those are your, your grabbable items from here. Um. Is there anything? What is this little building right here? Let's see if there's something in this little building down here. I think we already, I think we already went into here when it, right, right after we fought the boss. Yeah, that's where the little dude was. The uh, oops, scarab. Well, there was also a cookbook there, so I guess we got it. So that's cool. <laughs> Apparently, that worm face will fuck you up, though. Yeah, pathetic. Thank you. Take the compliment. All right. So now. We want to go here. Where's one marked at? Oh, there. All right, we're going to two. I think this is an ever gel over here. Oh, I guess we'll go grab our shit really quick. Yeah, he like, that was like a stagger lock, one, like, complete, couldn't do anything, just death right there. I, 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 I like everything else, I'm sure I missed something here, but let's just move on. What the fuck? Oh my god, stop. Hopefully this isn't ever gel here. That'd be cool. We haven't found one in a, in a minute. I feel like... I remember riding through, like, part of this area at least. Because I remember seeing the worm faces, but it could have been somewhere else. Oh.
Ooh, what, what do we got here? Is this another riddle? riddle? Touch three phantom crests. Mirage riddle. God damn it. There's one. Have you ever used a neti pot? I have not ever used a neti pot. Um, that's when you pour the water in your nose, right? And it comes out the other side or something. Right, Cookie? I believe that's what a neti pot is. Are they good for, like, cleaning your sinuses out? Alright, so I'm assuming... Uh... Where are we at here? So... There must be one over here then. Yes, I'm a... Someone would call me a genius. You boil the water first and let it cool. Oh yeah, so you clean the water pretty much before you pour it in your nose. That makes sense. You gotta also remember, Cookie, Pidgey's a little bit of a hypochondriac, whether he wants to admit it or not. So. He worries. Alright, so where is this last one at? It's way, it's by the bridge, okay. Stop. What is over there? A wormman. A wormman. Yeah, I'm sure there is a scenario where you could get messed up from it in some way. <laughs> you don't want to be just chomping on your Algebra 2 knowledge. <laughs> well, if you lose your Algebra 2 knowledge, then you can't do Algebra 3. Seems good. Yeah, I get my I get like really stuffed up too. Like when the weather changes and whatnot, like my sinuses. So maybe the never tried a neti pot though. It's very satisfying to get it all. I'm sure, yeah. I'm sure I'm sure like it, once it clears you out, it feels very nice. <laughs> Where is this thing? Where is this fucking shit at? Alright. What? Alright, so tower side of the bridge. Tower side of the bridge. Somewhere like right in here then. You use hot sauce and wash the notebook. <laughs> Clear your sinuses out. Alright, why did you spawn? Yeah, I feel like Wasabi would clear you out. A little bit spicy. Maybe it's over here on this side. Wait, you thought the 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 image the, the, the wasabi at Asian restaurants was was like green mayo and you ate all of it at one time? Yeah, I feel like that would mess you up a little bit. <laughs> I don't like spicy food either. So that'd be like a really bad day. <laughs> Why is the third one always a pain in the ass? 
Like, every time it never fails, it's always a pain in the ass. Like, well, it said mimicry ahead. So, the fact that these guys are over here means that it's over here somewhere. somewhere here. Oh, I see it. It's that rock right there, I think. Wow, that would have taken years to find. Anyways. <sighs> you went to an Asian noodle store once in Toronto with your friend Brian and his girlfriend from Japan. She ordered this rice cake dish that was too spicy for her, so Brian switched plates with her. He literally just shoveled in as fast as he could to get it over with. How bad was it? His entire head was beet red and he was dripping sweat. Oh my god. Yeah, that, that sounds uh, very uncomfortable. I don't like spicy food at all, like I'm saying, so I cannot handle shit like that. There's the tower. I'm guessing we're, we're gonna get another uh, medal or pendant in here or whatever to get more uh, more casting slots. You visited the Pepper Palace in New Orleans and tried their hottest ones. Yeah, that doesn't sound very fun. No, thank you. I'll pass on that. Unseen blade in unseen form. And a slumbering egg. What the fuck did we just find? A slumbering egg. Oh, we found those before. Okay. Well, then we'll, we'll, those are spells, I'm assuming. Of the unseen nature. Makes right hand armament completely invisible, makes the caster semi invisible. Oh, that's cool. Oh, kind of the theme. I get it. Yeah, for where we're at for the Mirage Rise. Alright, so that wasn't an Evergel, but still cool. Um Okay, so let's go here and then ride up here. See what that is, and then go down to where I wanted to go originally. Iker loves spicy food, really? Yeah, not not my not my forte. I'll eat some stuff, but it, like it gotta be like relatively tame, I think, for me to like it. Like you know, like if you get like loaded notches and they put jalapenos on them, I take the jalapenos off. That's that's the kind of person I am with spicy. Put what well, you put this you put like like hot like super hot hot sauce or something like that in, in spaghetti sauce and gave it to Iker? Is that what you're saying to me? You didn't tell him? Just trying to catch him off guard. Yeah, I don't like jalapenos. <laughs> like I said, I don't like spicy food, I'm a little bitch. And I I'm not even Jalapenos are, you know, spicy, but. I need my map. 
to open up. Thank you. Okay, so we're gonna. How does that even get? How does that get us over there? Wait, was something down? Did I ever? Hold on. Oh, wait, here we go. Can I try the world's hottest trip on stream? Hot, hottest uh, chip on stream? Yeah, uh, 1,000 followers and 50 subscribers. There you go. There is your goal. Lightning great ball ocean. Whoa, Barbie Horse Adventures 1,000 followers. Uh, one, yes, 1,000 followers, 50 subs. Where's that website to buy followers? <laughs> Please don't. All right, so I think I want to go this. Well, let's just follow this for the moment. Oh, the gray site. Grab it. I'm not a phony. Did I, so did I actually say at 1,000 followers we do Barbie Horse Adventures? Well, a lot of shit's happening at 1,000 followers apparently, okay? So get ready for a good time whenever we never, if we ever, if we eventually hit that. What is that? I didn't go in here before. <laughs> Wait, hey Paul, you streamer of phony, most likely. Great, a ball's fully turned on me now. I don't think I've been over here before. I feel like something is gonna happen. Nothing happened. Oh. Okay. World boss, Black Knife Assassin. Oh, I don't want to do this. Oh, shit. We got their dagger. Uh, dagger once belonged to the assassins who murdered God when the golden um, on the night of black knives. A ritual performed on the oddly misshapen blade imbued it with the power of the stolen rune of death. Unleash the power of the stolen rune as a powerful blade like projectile. Okay. So it's a dagger. Ooh! Okay. That's fancy. That's fancy right there. Uh, also, I feel like you'd get animation locked, but that was cool. That's cool. It's a custom move set, I think. Oh, this is where you fought the assassin at. Okay, nice. Oh, my. Is this another one of those hero tombs then? I hope not. Oh, it was. Please don't be chariots. Is it chariots, Icker? Can you tell me? Oh, it's like the easiest ones. Okay. Okay. I don't really care if it is, is easy. I just didn't really want to deal with the fucking chariots again. A uh, game. Let me play, please. Crimson seed tells me. I have some. Give you a crimson seed. Boost HP restoration from. Oh, that's kind of cool, but kind of unnecessary, I think. Do, do I have enough? Uh, hold on a second. Where? Uh, blasts. All right. I, I didn't know if I had any. I need. We have uh, missed a lot of tears. I feel like. My, fl my flasks are only plus eight. I don't know what max is, but I feel like we should be higher than that. You use ro roses as light a lot? What does that even mean? Roses as light.
What breed of dog can jump higher than a skyscraper? I don't, I don't know, Cookie. What breed? This enemy sucks ass. That was a weak one, though. Any breed of dog, sky, skyscrapers can't jump. All right, fair enough. That was good. Oh, Roses is like an ancient hero or some shit. Oh, and Elton the Elden Ring lore. Okay. You don't miss with those jokes, Cookie. I will give you that. Can I not hit you unless you're in the light? Is that the mechanic here? Yeah. Okay. All right, it's a heartless from, from fucking Lord of the Rings now. Or not Lord of the Rings, oh my God, from Kingdom Hearts. He's like, try me. I'm back where we started. You won as many Tour de France as Lance Armstrong? Zero? Did, did he never win any? Are you sure about that? I feel like that's an incorrect statement. I don't know the answer to that question, though. Why are they all rescinded? Try lowering out. Be wary of down. Oh, uh, was, was he doing steroids? Oh, once they're in the light. Okay. Alright, so once you reveal them, once you're good. You don't have to actually fight them in the light. Our heroes will block out the sun. We'll fight in the shade. Great movie. Incredible movie. Not historically accurate at all, but great movie. Oh, this is, looks, that looks fun. Yeah, the sequel's not even that good. There's a, there's a, why, why was it awkward besides the, the, uh, the sex scenes? Wait, and isn't it in Watchmen? You see, uh, you see the dude's dick, don't you? Like full on frontal dick. Mr. Manhattan or whatever his name is. I haven't watched that movie in a long time. Wasn't it good? Like Washington was good, wasn't it? You watched it with your. You guys saw what your mom. How old were you? We were young when Watchmen came out. I think. Dragon Crest Shield Talisman plus one. 
We're probably running low on stone sword keys at this point also. Lendell Soldier Ashes, cool. What are we supposed to drop down right there? You guys, that, that is actually hilarious though. Uh, this is where the floor gave out. Okay. I'm pretty sure that I saw Watchmen with my mom. But like, I don't know if it was in theaters or not. It might have been um, via DVD. I feel like 300 was awkward to watch with parents because there's like two sex scenes. Like, well, there's, there's like one or two sex scenes in it at the very beginning. There might be three in total, but they're like kind of graphic, graphic sex scenes. So when you're younger, that's like awkward to watch with a, like a parent. Oh, don't eat me. I mean, it's just a CGI penis, dude. We all have them. Okay, he killed himself. Nice. Yeah, I thought the movie was supposed to be pretty good. I can't remember. It's been a while. Apparently, the Watchmen comic books are also really good. Speaking of uh, comic book stuff, the uh, the new Batman movie is supposed to be incredible. The graphic novel is really good. Yeah, for for Watchmen. It's a fucking barbarian. Damn it. Probably in paint. Let's get to it. I actually just watched Dune not too long ago. It was very good. So, so I think a lot of you were iffy on Patterson being Batman, Icker, and apparently he fucking kills it. Oh, seriously? That's where you draw the line? This guy went to college dean's list. He he knew as soon as I crossed that threshold, he's like, nope, not 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 doing it. Please be a boss. Oh, did I just say there's an open from this side? I need to get a lever. Please go down, thank you. I'm assuming you climb ladders too, don't you? Having flashbacks to highlight to high school in the Twilight days? Yeah, it was Twilight. Dude, Twilight movies are not as bad as they could be. You spawn again? I'm not a Twilight hater, honestly. It wasn't that bad. I watched him. We all watched him. Come on now. He was good. He was good at Cedric and Harry Potter. Yeah, he was. Wait, lever ahead? Where was there a fucking lever at over here?
Wait, is there... You watched the first one, you were three, you hated it ever since. Are you talking about Twilight or Harry Potter uh, retro? There, There's no lever in this room, right? No. Oh, Twilight, yeah. Okay, um, that's not it. We, we were not in high school when the first one came out. I'm pretty sure we were older or younger than that. Someone give me a year check. What year did the first Twilight movie come out? All right, so there's no fucking lever in here. Okay, where's the fucking lever at? You're still a whole cookie. You're in the nursing home. When it came out. Come on. Oh. No, that was the lever for the door. <laughs> this guy, me, no go in light. The door opened. And we got a duelist great axe. Nice. Uh, weapon reserved for duelist champions. The charge is purely ferocious. Bonk. Teachers were trying to say your name were just like the vampire. Is that wait? Wasn't the isn't the vampire from Twilight? Isn't his name Ed Ed or something like that? Okay, so Cookie, you said that the first Twilight movie came out in 2008. So yeah, we I was in ninth grade. Okay, I guess I was in high school. I swear that it was out. Okay, fair enough. Boss fight. All right, this one was nowhere near. Are you fucking serious? Yeah, this wasn't as bad as the chariots. Some of our old teachers are still hot. Oh God. Like who? Ancient hero Zammer. Oh god, it's like a unique boss. I think. Ice, that's ice. Well, that was anticlimactic. Ancient Dragon Knight Kristoff. That is the person that RP told me to find. Cool. Very good tank, apparently. Uh, so you were in college, a bunch of girls in your dorm uh, bought the Twilight board game, and your friend Bridget and you played with them. No shit. We never saw the movie. You never saw the movie? But half the questions were about how many, how well you knew each other, so we ended up whining, and the girls who bought the game hated us. Uh... Yeah, it's like the Blizzard one trapped in the Evergel. Yeah, yeah.
I don't think I've seen all the Twilight movies. I've seen a couple of them at least at once upon a time. It's been a minute, like a long minute since I've seen them, but. What's our, how many souls do we have? 70,000 runes, yeah. Um, all right. Where was my marker at? Wasn't it like right here? So I'm pretty sure there's a, a dragon friend that comes through that's gonna show up over here. Lightning ram. Oh, this is the goat attack. That's fucking sick. Is there not? I swear there was a dragon that's supposed to show up here. It's not looking good though right now. Take that. Every time you get to watch them, you only watch the first three. Yeah. Whoa. What's up? What are you? What the fuck are you guys doing here? Who invited you to the party? This is where the dragon was for you. Okay. All right, dude. Fucking stop, you stupid NPC. Jeez. Electric Sheep is a novel by Philip K. Dick. <laughs> that is what that's what Blade Runner is based on. Wait, really? I can't tell if you're kidding or not. Maybe it's like right here somewhere. Oh yeah, here we go. There it is, Ancient Dragon Lanisax. This is Lightning Bolt Boy. That's sick. What is up, dude? Fucking oh my god, look at him. Oh, look at that! Fire. Oh no. I feel like using lightning against him isn't the move. That is so cool looking. Oh no. Is he gonna phase? What's he doing? He's flapping. Alright. This is that's the screenshot you ever saw one. Yeah, seriously. Dude's sick looking. Oh no, what is that? This lightning slam? I can't see what he's doing, but there's lightning bolts in his hand, I think. Ooh my god. Dude, that's a wild ass dragon right there. Holy shit. Look at the minute, like a badass just walking in front, like, nah, no big deal. Yeah, RP's playing this game too. He's trying to use that lightning like a laser fucking blade, I know, right? Alright, cool. That was a very cool dragon. There anything else over here? We'll go right there. Oh, there's something down. Or was that where we just were? No. The routing of the ancient dragons, Godwin the Golden fought to the last, earning the friendship of Dread Fortisax. Hmm. Uh, he did not beat the game yet. He's like the same point. He's like right ahead of me, I think. Pidgey. Might have passed him up now, but... Oh god, the electric sheep! Uh, so that sheep roll ability we just got hit with, I saw people doing sonic builds with it, it was fucking hilarious. Oh, is it a church of Marika right here? Please, be a, give me a seed. Stormcaller church, that's not, that's not what I was looking for.
Dragon Bolt Blessing. Secret as it's on your chest. Lightning Great Bolt, and this is the tier. Yep. All right, so we'll get the plus nine then on our flask with that. Nice. All right, so that was there. Um, I'm guessing there probably isn't a lot more over here. We never got down there. Uh, I already went to the graveyard up there. You're talking about this right here? We got the items from it already, didn't we? Yeah, we, we grab this stuff here. Yeah, that's the same here is grave right there. Alta's tunnel. Yeah. We didn't go there yet to this swamp looking place. Still need to do that. I think I did everything down here. Be something right there. I don't want to get right there though. Oh yeah, I don't know about the paintings. Yeah, I haven't. I found the only painting that I've successfully finished. I think is the one for the the bird, the bird summon. Part path side. Oh, was there something right there? Hold on. Uh, I don't know if all the paintings are, 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 are like give you something, but I know one of them I got a bird summon for. Oh, uh, there's a quest in that, that castle, in the poison castle for one of the characters. Do you, uh, which character is it for, Icker, by chance? Because I'll probably miss it if you don't tell me. Uh, what do you look for? So for the bird summon, it was just a ghost dude sitting on a chair that I talked to. No, it wasn't. It wasn't a chest. No. No chest. Oh, it's from Millicent. Okay. So, wait a second. Millicent's quest line. We, 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 we stabbed her with the needle, or she stabbed herself with the needle that was supposed to stop the Scarlet Rot, but it seemed like it was doing something bad to her. And we don't know what's going on with that right now. But she looks like Millennia, so I'm wondering if her and Millennia have something, or however Morgoth said. I wonder if they have something in common with each other. <laughs> hey, what's up, Adams? I sound ridiculous. You sound ridiculous. I don't know if I want to get to the poison castle right now. Oh, god damn it. I wandered over into the catapult range. There we go. Alright, so we'll take that away. Um, uh, okay, um, I want to go explore Upper Kalid, I think. We never finished that. What is the best way? We'll start from here. But first, let's go back to the uh, home base. Miyazaki goes to bed in a poison area. <laughs> All right, so we might have enough material to upgrade now. Don't know. Greetings, do you have a spirit? All right, so I believe our mimic is fully upgraded. So who are we gonna upgrade now? Uh, we can do some of the legendary spirits. So I was starting to upgrade to Oleg, who's pretty cool. We have Engval, we have the Bloodhound Knight, we have Latena, the Perfumer Trisha, L L Lutel, who's a legendary summon, Red Maiden Knight Oga, who's a uh, legendary summon, Ancient Dragon Knight Kristoff, legendary summon. I don't think I'm going to kill her now. Uh, and Black Knife Tish is also a legendary summon. 
map YXA for a quick travel to round table. I did know that actually, Adams, but thank you for, for, for saying that. I keep forgetting to do it. I think we'll use, so Aga uses a, like a gravity bow, like, like Radon, but we don't really need, let's, let's do Black Knight, Black Knight Tish. All right, now we have another fully upgraded summon, which I need to actually do this. Um, we need to put, how do I do this? How do you do this? Is it inventory? No, this, all right. So we're gonna do mimic tier here, black knife teach there. Yeah. We'll start using black knife teach instead of mimic summon just so we don't blow everything up so fast. He always thinks we're dead. All right, so I don't have any smithing stones eights to uh, to finish upgrading either of these things right now. And then Fia's gone. We know where Fia's at. We can finish her quest line. Um, we need to go to the Bell Maidens or whatever. No, actually, two things. Let's go to not the fingers, but. The fuck's their problem? The fuck are they doing? What the fuck am I looking at? Well, you managed to. What the actual you. fuck? You know what this means. The Earl Tree has burned you. The fingers remain still shaken by this turn of events. They are. Busy consulting the crater will. When they are finished, the fingers will again offer their This is uncomfortable. Guidance. About thousands, if not tens of thousands, of moons must first. No, pass. I didn't even meet the three fingers yet, no Adams. For me. I just beat Morgoth. But you, how will you ever manage to wait? My. All right. Fuck. All right. What do you got here? We got Verdon's gear still, that's it. Boring. I want to burn the impenetrable thorns. I'm not gonna tell her that right now, because I feel like I shouldn't tell her that. Uh, what does Morgoth make? He makes the, the Morgoth's Cursed Sword and Regal Omen Baron. Use FP to unleash many wraiths to chase down foe. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I haven't done anything with the madness yet, so I don't know. Apparently they do it if you beat Morgoth as well. Uh, let's see. Warp Blade of Shifting You, used by Morgoth the Omen King, the cursed blood that Morgoth recanted and sealed away, reformed into this blade. Huh. So, after Morgoth by default, but I think to what Adams is saying, I wonder if they do it whenever, if you can get, I don't know where the three fingers are. I haven't met them yet, so. I don't know if there's another trigger for them to do that or not, but that is uncomfortable looking. I don't trust the fingers anyway. We're not siding with them for the ending of the game. I know they have something to do with the ending of the game. We're not going down that route. It all. Uh, you. What is it? Uh, you don't care that I unlocated demigods. There are four more demigods yet to be located. Mikola of the Halig Tree, the Unalloyed, his twin Melania, the undefeated swordswoman Luna Princess Rani, daughter to Renala, and the one only known as the Lord of Blood. Rani is said to have cast aside her great rune, so here at the hold, we seek the whereabouts of the remaining three shard bearers. If you should learn anything of these matters, I'll trade your findings for a hidden treasure or a long lost right known only to me. We both desire to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord as such. I hope we are compelled to work together. Why would we work together, honestly? If you're heading, you'll need to find the go if you would. The two thing. Wait. If you're heading to the Forge of the Flame of Ruin, in the snowy mountain tops of the giant, you'll need to find the Grand Lift. Go if you would. Take no heed of Cardinal Sin. The two fingers lost their. P All right. So you're saying the two fingers are useless too? Good. Because that's what I was thinking. They're also fucking weird looking. I don't. I don't trust it. I want to talk to this dude too. We. I think we found his shit, but I'm not sure. Go and unshackle my corporeal trapped in this sewer jail below the I can kill you. Then the pot 
All right, he wants to give us the pox, which doesn't seem like it's very nice, <laughs> but... Okay, so I have not finished something over there then. Bell bearings, we have a fuck ton. So here's all of my bell bearings we found over the last fucking like six streams. All right, I want to get litany of proper death in order, but I don't care about that. And then we have those already. So now you sell up to smithing stone four and somber stone four and, and globe wart six. Cool. Ancient herpes. Yeah, I don't want the pox. I don't think anyone wants the pox, generally speaking. It's something you wouldn't want to get. I feel like I should have had those a long time ago. Yeah. I'm fucking getting tutorials fucking 65 hours into the game. Um. Alright, so that is done. So wait, Nefeli was over here somewhere. I don't know where she ever ended up going. Was she down? I think she was down under here. Pox on your house. No, no. How could I say, Father has all now? All right, you're still saying the same um, voice line. So you need to get over it, please, and do something. Unless there's a quest trigger for her that I've not done yet, maybe. All right, so let's. Um, flask. That's what I, I could not think of what I wanted to do. Upgrade the flask. There we go. And we don't have enough for any of this, right? Nope. All right. So we're gonna do. Yeah, ten. We'll say a ten and three. Um, what are we at? We're at fifty-seven thousand. What's the Lord's rune give us? Hopefully that wasn't important. Get in the flask. I want to. All right, vigor going to forty-five. Okay, so upper Kalid time. All right, there's that big dragon right there. The debuffs us. I don't want the debuff personally. I don't know if there's a way to sneak around him or not. Like, I, we, we want to go to the urge tree right there, and then also that, and then also that. Oh, I could have just teleported the right there, I guess. I don't know. Maybe we try to kill the big dragon. Can we kill the big dragon? You have to be able to kill the big dragon. Is he like rotting? He is rotting. Can't I know you can definitely kill him. All right, this might take a little while. Do we power through? a lot faster it bleeds i can believe that don't power through wait why give me a good reason not to oh there's an easier way okay i don't think i have any weapons um available that i can actually put on to do bleed damage sadly oh you're buffed aren't you oh there's a lot of you here huh Headshot. Dude, what the fuck? There's so many. Kill the other dragons. You, that's the easier way. Oh, why are they so... Where, where's your health bar at, bro? Alright, we're going dragon hunting, apparently. Are they, gonna, are they gonna breathe fire now?
Dude, we're going. We'll dragon hunt. That's what you want us to do. We'll do it. Also, what's up, Flex? How are you? Okay. Oh, yeah. We're debuffed right now. Oh, the, the mimic isn't debuffed, though. He's strong, boy. Oh, is the health bar the big dragon going now when you kill the little dragons? Still debating on this easier way you're claiming. with the fire one time. Yeah, I see why that, that spell's bad. The, the wind-up is way too long. He did 17,000 damage at one time. Oh. All right, whatever. Whatever. This attack is so weak, but I like, I don't like it to tell with. They make you block by roll. We're no longer friends. You almost dead, big guy? Yeah, you are. Alright, everyone quit yelling, please. What is the mimic at? What is he doing? Oh, he's right there. Oh, crit. Okay. Half the ram of your PS5 is in this big mama. It is a large dragon. I missed. It bit me midair. You gotta hate that. We have to focus on not dying here. Aim at me, not the mimic. These things do not uh, stagger either. One more, maybe? Oh no, it's dead. Dragon Arts from that. A new Draconic Power is available to you. Nice. And we got some flashback. And now, was there anything where this dragon was laying? No. Oh, well, no, that's the grace that we had already. So I'm assuming this dragon doesn't respawn right here, right? It feels like it's a safe assumption. Or at least if it did, that'd be kind of annoying. Oh, there's the the Kaled uh, Divine Tower right there. Okay. So, all right. Well, we did that. Um, I guess let's go to the Erd Tree. She's, she's the elder dragon mama. Yeah, so is that dragon supposed to be the same size as the one in the capital or close to it maybe? Because the one in the capital I'm still I'm, I'm sure I think is still like much larger But they're both ancient dragons, right? So that's why they're that big That's kind of cool. While there's kind of like a throwback to Dark Souls one with the world of the ancient dragons. I shouldn't hit that dragon Pissed Pissed
bears. Fucking bears, of course. Why am I going this way? There's no reason. The, the, the tree's up there. Alright, whatever. We'll entertain this thought for a second. Oh, cave. The Dragon Barrow Cave. I guess let's see what's in the Dragon Barrow Cave. Probably a fucking dragon. If I did. Oh, it's a bear. Well, actually, I didn't expect a giant bear, but all right. Why are you so tanky, dude? Holy shit. Hey, crit. Right in the head. Right in the noggin. Big old bonk. Did no damage. This is like one of the most difficult enemies to fight in the game, in my opinion. So he knocks you out of your, my, my ability that is hard to stagger out of. He respawns, of course he does. I win. We're too far in now, we gotta kill him. Oh, was it even worth anything? Probably not. Deer. I stole their crystal buds. They're getting high over there. Behold light. Ah, hello. Can I have this? Bull goats talisman. Not a hidden path. That's very nice. Wait, don't leave. I'm just, I'm just passing through. I don't mean to disturb you, small squirrel rabbits. I kind of feel bad for killing the bear. I feel like he was protecting all these small animals in the middle of Kaled. Well, you win some, you lose some. That bear lost some. Dog. Oh, there's the alpha right there. It'd be cool if there were werewolves in this game. I guess the, the, the beast knight dudes are kind of werewolves, and I guess Blade was a werewolf too. So fuck me, take back everything I just said there. Uh, yeah, that is Astol's attack from it's uh, Astol's remembrance. I am an idiot. How much? Oh, hold on one second. How much does Black Knight Knight the Black Knife Tish cost to summon? Should have looked at that before I wasted points on him. 132, what's my FP at? Probably 100. 130, I'm literally too short. That's so unfortunate. <laughs> I kind of 
As soon as I pressed the button, I'm like, oh, that's gonna end poorly. It did. All right, the mimic will avenge me though. So these are beasts of fair Missoula. Those are, we've been there before actually, through one of those teleporters. Just loading, loading, loading. Come on. Come on. Come on. I wonder if we have enough for one level. Probably not now, actually. Now we're gonna fall short. Maybe. There we go. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed watching, Pidgey. There. Now we do that. We do this. We can summon good old Black Knight. Black Knife Tish now. Against these fair Missoula boys. No, I honestly don't think we'll be that hard to kill. We'll see. Seriously? Like, why? You really are gonna just keep throwing things. Okay, you're you're the throwing knife variant. That's why you're doing that. Makes sense. Oh, you are not very strong, huh? Dude, look at let's watch the Tish fight. Okay. That's kind of a cool summon, actually. Damn. Dude's strong. Flame Drake Talisman 2, which is an item. Not necessarily super. Oh, we got a lot of a lot of runes from that, though. It says it is in, in his name. What, that he's super strong? <laughs> well, we can level up again. Might as well do that. Almost there to our 45 vigor. Oh, the throwing knife, dude. Sorry. Um, why? Why, game? It rolled off the side of the cliff. Huh. All right. Well, why'd that happen? Is something... Oh, God. Oh, it's the defense system for whatever this is right here. Oh, when's a fucking puzzle? Wait, lens rise. Oh, we've been here already. <laughs> I was going to say, I thought we've been to this place before we have.
Because that's where the beast shit stuff is over there. Alright. We're going to go back down this way. And speed run around and go up to the Erd tree. Which I'm guessing there's going to be an avatar there we have to fight. And get more stuff to upgrade our flasks. We didn't do anything tonight. I guess we fought a, another major boss. So we did make progress overall. Even though that major boss was like five minutes from where we left off last time. <clears throat> I still am missing something in the sewers. I don't, I guess I don't know where the actual, like, the, the full sewer area is. Um, in. In the capital, because I thought we found the item for a uh, fucking dung eater, dude, but if we didn't. Where's the avatar at? There it is. Hold on one second. Buff up. Alright, now let's do it. The putrid avatar. It's gonna be a, a, a rot, a scarlet crimson rot one. Oh yeah, we fought one of these already. It's as fun as the first one was. Yeah, okay. Well, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. GG, Erd Tree Avatar. Give me your stuff. Opaline Hard Tier and Stone Barb Cracked Tier. Nice. Why did I remove the light ability? The light ability? Which light ability cookie? I don't, I don't remember. The one that made little balls of light that one shot the enemy. Oh, are you talking about whenever I was slamming my sword on the ground? Okay, yeah, yeah. Because this wave of darkness attack um, this was doing a lot of damage, and it would look really cool. I can switch back to that, though, at some point. That's actually the ability that the thing I just killed uses. Oh, this is a boss. Is that dragon dead, or is it... It gotta be dead. It was... Oh, okay. There, there's the beast thing over there. Is this a... Wait, are you a boss? You look like you're a boss, the way you're standing there like that. Hi. Flying Dragon Grail, you are a boss. Is it Flying Dragon? That was fire. We haven't had any death root in a long time. We still have to finish the wrong side quest with a death root. Oh no. Look at those dodges by Tish. Fuck you in the toe. Alright. 
nose bomb or not. Don't do it. And also the current the, the current attack I'm using now, the purple gravity attack, was also a boss ability. And we I, we haven't used any of the boss items the entire game, so I thought it'd be cool to try to use one. Really? Dragon heart. We have so many dragon hearts, but no dragon abilities. Well, we didn't try. I haven't bought any dragon abilities, I should say. All right. So we did the Erd tree. Did that. Let's go here. All right. I think that's two level ups, actually. Oh yeah, all right, so 45, and then we'll put some of the strength. We're gonna pump strength to 66, I think, and then we'll be done with that. Then we'll have some points to spare, we can spread around to other things. All right, so, next time, we're gonna go there, then here. Uh, and I think that's everything for the upper part of Kaled because we already have been here so We've been here. There's a boss in front of here that we could do Fuck that too So we'll finish upper Kaled and then we can go To the Forbidden Lands and work our way over to here Get the take the great lift of roll to the, the snow area Get the thing use this thing then do the last invasion for the manor Get the reward from that, and then just keep on chugging along. I don't think I missed anything down here. I'm sure I did. I, I feel like I didn't, but I'm sure I did. So, all right, cool. Yeah. So yeah, I think with that, guys, we're gonna wrap up for tonight. As always, I hope you enjoyed the stream. I will see you guys tomorrow night for some more Elden Ring. Good night. See ya. Peace. Bye.